But you're not going to help me out today. Why? Well, because in the second session I asked a little earlier. With what? About it being an uh, MP Ultra fat member. MP. MK Ultra. Uh, have you ever heard of MP Ultra? Yeah, I'm not sure. No, no, no. no. Oh. Explain. Ah, well, I would not. <laughs> I'm the least free. I would not. But well, how would you want to help? I mean, no, no, no. I, uh, I'm really okay. Uh, I don't need that. I, I have proven my case. So maybe I could help other people, but as far as that, I'm okay. So okay. how are you? I'm very well, thank you. Very well. Me not. Are you gonna get better? I hope so. With a help like this, how can you even stay me not? Oh, uh, well, hey, she's going to make you feel better. Thank you. We have an answer. We have an answer. We have an answer. That's all right. And enjoy the fall. friend from Colorado, uh, ex MKO trust staff member indeed, a really really nice individual. Uh, hello, today is November the 6th, 2018 and I welcome you uh, to this uh, portion of uh, documentary videos about MK Ultra. Uh, and in this video what I'm gonna do is I will address a gentleman who came to rescue yesterday uh, at a Mary Hospital in Zgirs, that's the second biggest city in Poland known as Lodz, Watch in Polish. Uh, you stated, sir, that you will help me out uh, with testimony in respect to my MK Ultra case unless I would state something is that crazy it was sometimes in 2004 I believe you stated this but I'm gonna go right in between 2004 2006 thank you very much for returning me a confidence you know I uh, I am gonna talk in the next documentary about construction that took place in Zgirsch 
and I will talk about apartment which gentleman bought in Zgersh. A uh, gentleman whom I have met in the middle of the forest and I knew exactly in what part of the forest is going to come out. And I'm going to talk about his business place. I'm going to point out exact his business location where his business was located. Uh, stuff like this I'm going to talk about, sir. And believe me, you gave me confidence back because Serbs brought me back in 2010, 2012, together with the Ruskis, Valerio, the guy in the center, Valerio, this is, this is the dude that was police officer from Minsk, this is the dude that was a frequent companion, whenever the Ruskis would be, he would be there. This was a part of uh, MK Ultra team. You have no idea, sir, uh, what they have done to me. It's not that I'm crazy. They, uh, my niece's husband tr created also tremendous ordeal. He created tremendously a lot of problems. He created huge problems for me in respect to the timing. When they brought me back here from Slovenia, they brought me back to Denbot near Warsaw. Uh, they brought me back to Novi Turk and they have confused with the construction and other things they have done is they have uh, attempted to confuse even with three-dimensional Google's uh, technology that was done sometimes I have no idea maybe in 2000 and something like this earlier uh, I am in particular talking about the fuel station located in Novi Turk and I'm particularly talking about Novi Turk and I'm particularly talking referring to construction building located in Prusko sorry Prusko uh, near Denbach, uh, Warsaw. So I'm talking about two locations, Novi Turk and Prusko. You have no idea what they have done to me. You have no idea what I was told. When you're hospitalized based on lies, complete lies, such a bogus lies that the whole world could see and have seen that they can just go and they can just write whatever they want to write, basically, and get and do with you whatever they want to do. You have no idea how that feels. You have no idea how how it feels when, when you are tortured. I was tortured for five years by psychiatrists in Slovenia. Almost two years I was hospitalized and you have no idea how many times I was taught and reminded then by the nurses who participated in MK Ultra. Uh, Andrea Yerich, Andrea Yerich. Uh, really a nice girl. I have fallen for and she have fallen for me, but things became so twisted that it it, it, it must have been beyond disappointing for her. Uh, people started to hate me and I will I will explain I will explain more about what went on because I have to produce quite a few videos. Um, psychiatrists told me that the moment I'm gonna even mention the word MK Ultra Psychiatrists involved in, in MK Ultra, psychiatrists that tortured under MK Ultra, was the psychiatrist who got me in hands afterwards in Slovenia and have abused this nurse actually. This is a very nice girl. Abused her, told her what she has to do when visiting me at home. So I, whenever they got in touch with me, I got, whenever she got in touch with me, I was terrorized, you have no idea, for five years. And I, despite all that stuff, I kept going. My niece's uh, husband, what he did is disgusting, what this guy did. How he tried, for the sake of the big Serbia, how he tried to, how he lied and how he tried to confuse in 2012, 2015, I believe. For sure, 2015. They brought me back to Poland. Polish politicians did not even know that we were inside of the Poland. At one time they find out and they were like shocked that they brought me back and they start doing this kind of stuff. 
without even their knowledge about what's going on and stuff like that. They were concerned, they became concerned. Mr. Kaczynski became concerned. But there's nothing you can do, not even as a politician. Not even as a politician, there's nothing you can do. I have to explain more about this because this is so twisted, this is so complicated. I already did, but you have no idea when the world politicians like this, when they get involved, you have no idea what kind of pressure what kind of pressure is this? They have done worse things than to me, to other people. Maybe not so, because I don't think so, but I really feel sorry for the ladies. Uh, and, you know, nobody even opened mouths like this. And I went on like this. I went on like this since 2006. This is not a joke when you go stuff like, uh, when you do the stuff like this. You're gonna see, you, you returned me a confidence, thanks to you, you reminded me 2004, 2006. That's why I said 2005, right in between. You returned me a confidence in the next video, I will discuss exact location of the gentleman, uh, his apartment uh, in the city's Gersh, where, at least this is what I was told when brought inside of his apartment supposedly where he is located at uh, and I'm gonna discuss exact business location where his business was located I'm gonna do that too that's how good my memory is my memory is not bad it's just they they did so much bad stuff and I... <laughs> yeah she wants to she wants to go she wants to go with me on a... I'm gonna take you to Hollywood I'll take you to Hollywood. Bye bye. Okay. Uh, you have no idea. You have no idea about. Yeah, that was really nice interrupting me. Uh, but anyhow. Um, uh, yeah. What I will do. What I will do is in the next video. Uh, and I would really like you to get involved more in it. Uh, I will discuss also a construction, same way I did in for the Noviturk and Zakopani for a little portion of town known as Girsh. I mean, the stuff I'm gonna do, it's the stuff that, if you don't know, uh, like I knew exactly where the gentleman is going to come out of the forest now I know all this information how the hell are you going to do it where are you going to pull all this information from if it was not for MK Ultra? Um, that much about this concerning other issues uh, it's like this you did have a leg broken your leg is broken not now your leg was broken uh, unless, unless you broke one now and you have a doppelganger, but your leg was broken already in 2004, I believe. Because when we came to this exact same hospital, uh, you already were uh, cured. And, but you, you, you were telling us about how you had this kind of fractures and so on and stuff like this. And you said, well, if you're going to say that my leg was broken, this and that, uh, we gonna, we have done it in a such a way that uh, it's not going to be you're not going to be able to prove uh, it will be good also for the future. So I'm saying that your leg uh, was not broken the last time I met you. Uh, in respect to, you, to the girl, uh, that's a beautiful girl. I would not miss. In no way I could possibly miss. Uh, the girl actually got. As far as I remember, I think she got married, something like this. But back then you guys were kind of interested in one another and you gestured that you would be even interested in uh, going to Poland and being in Poland. Um, you like Poland a lot, that if you would have to, that you would consider one. Okay, that you did not even know about what NK Ultra is, that's kind of funny. Um, 
Yeah, I would need to uh, see a little bit more to pull some more stuff on you. Uh, but that's already something little that I pull out of my head. And uh, yeah, that's my claim, basically in respect to this case. Uh, really, uh, rewards are one-time deal, but a good employment uh, with great people around, which I'm looking forward to. Productive environment, that's something completely different. You definitely were an MKUltra staff member. This is, ladies and gentlemen, uh, accounts about a gentleman, American, who actually came to rescue. Uh, I really appreciate it and I hope, sir, I hope you're going to come forward and confirm stated here. Uh, thanks for watching this video. Uh, next, coming next, it's going to be about a gentleman whom I have met in the forest in, uh, near cities, Gersh. And uh, then I knew exactly uh, where to look for one, <laughs> where he's going to come out of the forest. And just disregard that, she is a little crazy too. <laughs>